Good evening, this is Darnold from Porsche of Ocala. I just wanted to take a moment to show you the 2018 Porsche Cayenne. This vehicle is powered by 3.6 V6 engines, naturally aspirated, 300 horsepower, 295 pound foot of torque. It's a very impressive engine, very impressive vehicle. It puts the power down with an all wheel drive system through an eight speed automatic transmission. The Cayenne is a very unique SUV, uh, considering it is a little bit more performance driven than most vehicles in its class. As you can see from the front alone, you look underneath the car, there's little channels for the air to pass through to help with the stability of the vehicle. You have the parking sensors on this vehicle. Uh, inside the grill, you have these flaps that are active. So they're open and closed on their own to help control the airflow going where it needs to. You do have four point LED daytime running lights. This vehicle is equipped with the premium package plus and it has the Porsche Dynamic Light System Plus. So what that means is you get the upgraded LED headlight as well as having the LED daytime running lights and the, uh, the cornering capabilities with the headlight and then you have the high beam assist as well. Cayenne has always had very sporty styling very sleek design you have the entry and drive option on this vehicle so if you look here on the door handle you have a button for you to press to lock the vehicle and then there's a sensor inside the door handle to unlock it that's on all four doors considering it is an SUV so as long as the keys within four feet of the vehicle you'll have no problem unlocking and locking the vehicle with the way this is equipped you do have a shade here on the window for your rear passengers it is powered, unlike some of uh, the other ones that are out there where you have a handle that releases them. As soon as you hit the button for the window to roll it down, it goes down on its own. And then if you pull it up, it will go up as well. You do have the power tailgate as standard. There's a micro switch on the tailgate so that you can open it up. You can actually adjust the height of the tailgate very easily with the left button that's back here on the tailgate. You just press and hold it once you have it on the desired height and then it'll beep and store in the memory which is a really convenient option. You do have four point LED brake lights that are standard on the Cayenne. So the LEDs are gonna be very bright so that the people behind you will notice it. This vehicle is equipped with the tow package. You have the dual exhaust in the rear to give it again the sporty look that's known for Porsche. With the tow hitch on the vehicle, the vehicle can tow up to 7,700 pounds, which is class leading. It's very impressive for a vehicle this size. You have your spare tire underneath. This vehicle does have the privacy shade back here. It's very easy to remove uh, so that people can't see the, the contents of your, your trunk. Uh, the seats fold down to 40, 20, 40 split. The second button that's on the tailgate actually will close the hatch and lock the vehicle. Like I said, everything's functional on the Porsche, so you can see the rear spoiler here to help uh, with the downforce on the vehicle. The seats fold down very easily. There's a lever here, you pull this, and then it releases the seat. Once the seat's all the way down, it actually locks into place. And then there's a handle here right in front of the seat. This will allow you to actually pull the seat forward just in case you need just a little bit more space without having to fold the seats down. You do have vents in the rear for your passengers. Heated seats as well. Going up front, you have the memory package with the 14-way seats. This vehicle is equipped with Porsche's lane change assist. The lane change assist is gonna be here in the mirror. So once this is active, this, you'll see this light. So once someone's in your blind spot using a radar system that's in the back of the car, the lights will come on. If you were to switch lanes, uh, you put on your turn signal and go to switch lanes, the vehicle is going to flash that light rapidly so you know not to switch lanes. You do have a button on the door so you can operate the tailgate from the driver's seat. You have the five instrument clusters like you would in the 911. The digital one here is a TFT display. 
has a lot of information that's that's on there before that we'll go over uh, to the PCM and this is the PCM with navigation which is standard on the Cayennes the touch screen radio you have a proximity sensor so once your hand gets close to the screen the menu necessary menu pops up with the options that you have to uh, to select in the menu that you're in there's a lot of buttons up here it's all done for simplicity you do have your climate driver side climate settings on the passenger side and then you have uh, additional options that would be below this vehicle is very well equipped you have uh, heated and ventilated seats on the driver and passenger side you have an off an on road mode the car uh, starts in the on road mode and with this toggle you can switch it you have your sport mode you have your automatic start and stop this is the lane departure warning, so if you drift out of the lane, the vehicle uh, will buzz and let you know that you're actually drifting out of the lane, and then you have your uh, PSM, your Porsche Stability Management. And going back up here to the steering wheel, you have this new wonderful design that started with the 918 and has now trickled down into all of the, uh, the Porsche lineup. The multifunction is only standard on the Panameras, the Cayennes, and the Macanzo. So on the left side of the steering wheel, you have uh, adjustment for your volume for the radio you have this diamond shaped button which uh, uh, is your steering wheel button it allows you to store you know different settings uh, so as a default this will allow you to switch between media sources but you're not limited to that if you go into the settings you can actually change it that let's say you wanted to uh, activate and deactivate your start and stop button without having to take your hand off the wheel you can program it to that button you have a button here uh, to answer the phone on the right side, you have a button to hang up the phone, your back button for the TFT display, and then the roller that controls the TFT display. So the roller here, if you use this and scroll down, right here we're on the vehicle menu, shows you quite a bit of information, and you can customize the layout of this and personalize it for you. You have your radio stations there, so, and once you click in, you can go to different stations. It's on satellite radio right now. Uh, the navigation screen allows you to look at previous destinations that were added to the navigation, but when you're using the navigation, this is actually going to show you a turn-by-turn -turn directions. Then you have your map here, uh, so you don't have to have the map on the, uh, the main PCM you have right in front of you. Your phone function, so you can see your contacts and call history and actually dial out from here. Your trip computer, your tire pressure, and then back around to the vehicle menu, which will also give you access uh, to your oil because there is no dipstick in the vehicle anymore. Um, you check everything electronically and as well as adding it to your setting, access to your settings. Uh, so you'll be able to access all your settings from here. Now this vehicle does have a little extra to it. It has what Porsche calls the Porsche Connect Plus now. Uh, so what you have with that is if you have an, uh, an iPhone, you can plug your iPhone in and use Apple CarPlay. You also have an a, uh, application that you can download on your phone that creates a, a link between your car and the phone um, as well as having an AT&T SIM card that you're that you're given so you can use uh, Wi-Fi capabilities you can actually use Wi-Fi in the car for online services <clears throat> or you can use the car itself as a hotspot let's take one more look at the 2018 Porsche Cayenne. Definitely a beautiful color. Hope you enjoyed the video. And we look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you.